Hi everyone. Welcome to my channel The Haunting of Shinigami. This is a story about real event in a haunted abundant house. Hope you guys like it. The Abandoned House on the Hill There was a house on the hill that nobody ever talked about. It was a large old mansion that had been abandoned for as long as anyone could remember. The windows were boarded up and the paint was peeling from the walls. Rumors circulated about what had happened to the family that used to live there, but nobody knew for sure. One night, a group of teenagers decided to explore the abandoned house. They had heard stories about strange noises and ghostly apparitions, but they didn't believe in such things. They were looking for a thrill, something to brag about to their friends. They climbed the hill and approached the house which loomed before them like a dark, ominous shadow. The door was locked, but they found a way inside through a broken window. They shone their flashlights around the dusty old rooms, looking for anything interesting. Suddenly, they heard a faint whispering sound, like the wind blowing through the cracks in the walls. They brushed it off as their imagination and continued exploring. But then they heard it again, louder this time, and more distinct. It sounded like the woman's voice, murmuring something unintelligible. They followed the sound to a hidden staircase that led down into the basement. As they descended the creaky old steps, the whispering grew louder and more intense. When they reached the bottom, they found themselves in a dimly lit room, filled with dusty old furniture and cobwebs. In the center of the room, they saw a strange, shadowy figure. It was hard to make out any details, but it seemed to be a woman, dressed in a long, flowing gown. She beckoned them closer, her voice growing louder and more urgent. As they approached, they suddenly felt a cold breeze blowing through the room, chilling them to the bone. They tried to run, but found themselves frozen in place, unable to move. The figure approached them, her eyes glowing with an eerie, otherworldly light. She spoke to them in a whisper, telling them of the terrible tragedy that had befallen her family. She had been trapped in the house for centuries, unable to escape the terrible curse that had been placed upon her. The teenagers tried to scream, but no sound would come out. They were trapped in the basement with the ghostly figure, unable to move or escape. The woman's voice grew louder and more insistent, filling their minds with terror and despair. Finally, after what felt like an eternity, the ghostly figure disappeared, leaving the teenagers trembling and gasping for breath. They stumbled back up the stairs and out of the house, never to return again. From that day forward, the abandoned house on the hill was known as the most haunted place in town. Nobody dared to go near it for fear of encountering the ghostly figure that lurked within its walls. And as for the teenagers, they never forgot their brush with the supernatural, and they never spoke of it again. No more stories like this. Thank you for listening.